Hello everyone, and today I'm doing a review on the Steam uh, Steam controller. For some reason, my camera's all backwards. I don't know why. Can't fix it for some reason. But back to the point. So the Steam controller is a PC gaming controller, and it has a bunch of you know awesome little buttons and everything. But there's like okay, so. This is basically your mouse trackpad thing. It's like your D-pad. Then again, it is backwards, so it's like... I, I, I don't know. But you know what I mean? Sort of. I guess. Maybe. But... So the average A, A, B, Y, and X. Sort of like the Xbox, but, you know. And then there's the analog stick. You can press it in too. The cool thing about this is that it has two buttons in the in the back. There's also um, these triggers and then shoulder buttons. You can plug it in and then also put batteries in it. So then this is to you connect it to your PC so you can use it wireless. And then if you're getting a bad wireless connection, you use this. You can also charge with this and then this to make it like longer. Uh, if you're like farther out. And, um, so, basically, that's, that's pretty much the Steam Controller. It's, uh, it's about $60 Canadian, and, or wait, that's just, you know, probably about $60 Canadian. And, well, you know, it's, okay, the thing that I like about this is, is just that, literally, um, like most gaming controllers you can't use on the PC because, um, it has this, like, you know, right here, because you sort of need a mouse for some games on the PC. One thing is you need Steam, and, uh. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Please like, dislike if you didn't like this, and please subscribe.